Hi guys, it's Kai here and welcome back to my channel and welcome to uh, The Sims 3. <laughs> no, it doesn't look like it because you're just looking at my face right now, but I wanted to show you guys, I guess, the entire experience uh, because for those of you who haven't seen The Sims 3, it launches up a little bit differently uh, than The Sims 4. And also just keep in mind, it's been about six years or so since I've played The Sims 3, so I haven't seen this in a long time. But full disclosure, I did try to record this video the other day, so technically I have seen it, but um, I forgot to click record on OBS. So I'm not mad at OBS anymore, so I'm ready to record again. Uh, it just makes me sad. But okay, anyways, I've got, so you can see my desktop screen right now um, because I didn't know how else to <laughs> record this. So don't mind being able to see everything else that I have going on. This is how I record, <laughs> fun fact. <laughs> but this is the game launcher and it's great that it, it uh, shows off The Sims 4. <laughs> Even Sims 3 is self-aware enough to know that not all of the expansion packs will run at the same time very well. And somehow I have I have The Sims 3 and then like certain expansion packs. So I have Ambitions, High End Loft Stuff, Late Night, Pets, and World Adventures installed. I don't recall getting these on Origin. Now when I had The Sims 3 on my old computer and a different Origin login, I had all of them. Uh, but I don't know how they got here. So I'm just going to accept it for what it is and do that. Um, but it says to select only a couple packs at a time. I think this is enough to play just fine. So I have some packs, not all of them. I really wish I had Generations because that would be really fun to play with. Um, but for now, we're going to play with this. So we're just going to click the little play button and prepare for it to go. Oh, yes, I definitely have Reshade installed. I don't know if you guys can see it pop up because I was on Twitter the other day and someone posted some screenshots they had um, from The Sims 3 and I was like, oh my God, this lighting looks amazing. Which again, if you haven't seen Sims 3, you'll know that The Sims 3 lighting was garbage to say the least. Um, so I put Reshade on with a certain preset and it looks, so far it looks the same. Graphics aren't the greatest, but you know, it was The Sims 3. This came out in like, 20 something. I don't know. Long time ago. I'll relook it up. This is amazing though. I love this so much. Also, a lot of this intro is like a full on lie for the beginning of the game. Like, if you only had base game and you saw this, you'd be like, oh my god, I can do so many things. And it's like, you couldn't do all of it yet. This is so good though. Oh my god. I'm so excited. Also, I don't have any mods installed. When I played The Sims 3 way back when, when I originally played it, I had so much CC and so many mods uh, that that's probably why my game didn't work well. But I wanted to play it without that for now. And then maybe if we continue playing this game, I will add those things just to see what it's like and have fun with it. But this is great. Oh my God. I have like literal goosebumps. <laughs> Oh, the music. Hopefully this doesn't get copywritten. Also, I'm glad we have pets because <laughs> Sims 3 Pets was actually the reason I moved on from Sims 2 to Sims 3. I didn't move on from Sims 2 when Sims 3 first came out. I was stuck on Sims 2. I love Sims 2, but I don't have access to Sims 2 anymore because I don't have the discs and you can't get it online anywhere by proper means. So I don't have The Sims 2 even though I really desperately want to play it. So if anybody can hook me up or let me know where to get some for a decent price, that'd be awesome. But in The Sims 3, as soon as I bought, or someone bought me the Pets expansion pack and I saw that it had horses, that's what convinced me to move on. I was like, that's it. We're wrapping up The Sims 2 and moving on to The Sims 3. Okay, so this is a sim when I, I made when I was like testing, but I'm going to make a new game. We're going to start from the freaking beginning and we're going to go through create a sim and everything. And I feel like... I don't remember Adventureland. <laughs> I remember Appaloosa Plains. I loved it. Bridgeport was my jam though. I used to put my sims in Bridgeport all the time. Like all the time. Sunset Valley is so nostalgic though. <sighs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna have to go Bridgeport. I'm gonna have to go Bridgeport. Oh my god, these loading screens. <laughs> Y'all want to complain about loading screens in The Sims 4? Girl. <laughs> Sims 3 much worse. May have been open world, but these loading screens to get in there were rough. Also, I guess now I can talk about the fact that uh, my unpopular opinion is I don't want open worlds. I think open worlds is what destroyed The Sims 3. It constantly had to have everything loaded and that's really what bogged it down and a lot of people couldn't play The Sims 3 on their regular computers. 
Now, I would love open neighborhoods. So, like, once you load it into a neighborhood, you could go to, like, however many houses are in that neighborhood. I think that would be cool. Then you could seamlessly move between those. But open world in general, I don't want it. Basically, these loading screens are just a big ad for all the other expansions. <gasps> oh. My god. Bridgeport was so dark. <laughs> Maybe that's why I liked it. Oh. My god. I quite literally have goosebumps. I- oh my god, I used to play this game so much. <gasps> I wish I was faking it right now, but I am like, I literally have goosebumps. Like, the wave of nostalgia is just like coming over me. Like, I can't even. Like, it's so dark. <laughs> this is literally how it was though. <gasps> oh my god, I miss this place. Okay, so we're gonna create a household. I think I'm gonna start with just a single sim. I'm <laughs> just so excited. <laughs> oh my god, I remember having so much CC. I had so many different skin tones because these ones are like not the greatest. Oh my god. Maybe I should have. I normally would make a male or female sim, but I think maybe we'll have a male. Nolan? I like the name Nolan. Okay, Nolan. Actually, no, I wanna name him Sebastian. I've been on a kick recently with the name Sebastian. I don't know why, because I want to be able to call someone Seb. Okay, that's probably fine. All right, let's see what we have for hair. I want regular hair. I don't want no hats. Oh my. Can we, oh. Yikes, dude. <laughs> Sims 3 was never like on trend with the current styles. I will say that. And I think that's why I relied so heavily on CC was because it just, nothing was ever on trend. Ever. Wow. If that ain't Justin Bieber, I don't know who is. Dude, I'm going to need some CC for this game. This is fine. Okay. <laughs> I do like how, so again, unpopular opinion. I do not like the color wheel, but I do like it for hair. Because I think you can create some interesting hair colors out of it. Okay. That seems subtle, but a little bit of dimension. This is not my favorite hairstyle by any means, but, you know. Oh, man. Oh, and I can change his eyelashes. Holy crap. Let's give him a little bit of eyelash, but not too much. Oh, my God. That's right. They had body hair. Dude's got thick thighs. Damn. Oh, my God. We got. I mean, we have to give him body hair, right? I feel like we just have to. Just a little, you know? Just a little because we can. We can. I can give him back hair. Oh, my God. Arm hair? Hell, yeah. Just a little bit of arm hair. Is that... Oh, leg hair. I was like, don't tell me that's like foot hair. Dudes could be hairy, man. Oh my god. Okay, maybe no on the leg hair. <laughs> it just looks a little strange. Okay, let's get like real detailed on this face here. So you could always go into advanced mode, which again, everything's done by sliders. Look, I'm gonna try my hardest to make dudes attractive, but like, this is tough. I can't even make Sims in The Sims 4, let alone this. <laughs> okay, let's change his eyes because I'm really having a hard time here. Oh my god, that's terrifying. I realized that he's kind of starting to look like um, Henry <laughs> from <laughs> another game I play. <laughs> so whoops on that uh, front. I can't state his eyes, but I don't know what to do about it. So um, he's fine. <laughs> he's fine. He's fine. All right, clothes. Oh my god. I'm not going to have much to choose from because I don't have a ton installed, but we'll try and make him look kind of cute casual. Okay, I'm into that. I don't re I don't remember most of these clothes, to be honest. Those are definitely riding pants. I think I use these ripped jeans all the time, like all the time. Also, keep in mind, we can change the color of damn near anything, so... You know what? Let's use the ripped jeans and let me see if I can change to like a, oh, a blue. I, oh man, I had it and I should have just left it. I like those. Okay. Shoes. Do we have like normal looking some things? These. These two sets of shoes were always, always, always always my go-to like i feel like i have to use them just because i use them so often way back then but we need to make them 
white. I want to make them white, though. Here we go. I want it to be, like, white, white. Here we go. So then what's this? Oh, the bottoms? Okay, we can make those black. And what is this? The laces. Um, we'll leave them like that. Dude, he looks like Henry. <laughs> Anyone that watches me stream would know, will know exactly what I'm talking about. He looks like Henry. <laughs> My bad. And then the best part, his personality. Oh, we can pick his favorites. <laughs> I missed that. Okay, so let's add his traits. So let's see, we're going to make him adventurous. Animal lover for sure, because we'll be playing with pets at some point. Eco-friendly? Hell yeah. Flirty. And maybe good sense of humor. So, like, he's all around just gonna be a good dude. Alright, so he could- oh, okay. Or he could be a heartbreaker. Arc builder. Great explorer. Golden tongue, golden fingers. Or seasoned traveler. I like the idea of seasoned traveler, because World Adventures was actually one of my favorite expansion packs back when I played this. Um, I had such a hard time playing it there because it constantly would crash. So I'm hoping that we'll be able to play it with no problem. All right, so let's pick his favorite food. Oh my God, there's so many. <gasps> Egg rolls. Nope, mac and cheese. Favorite music is gonna be, let's see. Let's make it hip hop. And his favorite color is gonna be blue. What's he sound like? Sounds kind of normal. And his astrological sign is Cancer? No, let's make him... We'll make him like me. We'll make him a Libra. I don't know if that has anything to do with anything, but... Should we get him a pet right away? No. No. We'll wait on the pet. We'll wait on the pet. Gotta keep you guys interested somehow. Alright, so here's my dude. He's chill. He's cool. Let's move him into... An apartment. A freaking apartment. Uh, studio. Okay. Studio with one bath. And this one's also a studio with one bath. And then this one is one bedroom, one bath. You know what? Let's go with a studio apartment, I think. One bedroom, one bath. That one doesn't really say. I want to live right in the middle of town. I'm really tempted to live in this one. Furnish is 23. Don't have that. Furnish is 4. So I have a feeling we're going to have to live in this one because the other one is damn expensive. So let's go in here. And for now, I'm going to do furnished just for the hell of it. And we'll upgrade as things go along. Oh my god. I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm so excited. We're going to have to get him a job like right away because we're going to need money to be able to travel. I don't want to cheat. Um, I always would cheat when I was playing The Sims 3, but I don't want to. <gasps> oh my god. You are now living in a high-rise building. Hell yeah, I am. Oh my god. And I forgot about... <laughs> oh, the journalism career. I could do that. And visit Ch Chompsley Sims. Oh my god, this is such a tiny little apartment. I love it so much. <gasps> oh my god. Dudes. I'm... It's 8 a.m. Okay, so where's the newspaper then? And I'm just going to stare at the ground <laughs> until someone drops off a newspaper because that's how we have to find a job. You can't just do it on your phone because there is no phone. Well, actually, I think you can buy phones somewhere, but I don't 100% remember where. Do you think the news will come to or newspaper will come today? Would you stop with the tutorials? I know how to play this game. The thing is, though, learn athletic skill. I can do that. Take a class? No, we can't afford that. Okay, so you're going to stop that. And why don't we work out? Let's do some strength training. Um, I don't remember everything from this game, like all the little hidden stuff, because this was something that I played when I was younger and didn't spend a lot of time. I didn't spend a lot of time online figuring things out or like Googling how to do things. <gasps> newspaper boy. He's here. He's here. Drop off the newspaper. Where is he? Hell yeah. Okay. Um, jobs and professions. Find a job. Let me see. Let's see if we can find... So he wants to join the journalism career. Let's see if we can do that. Because, again, with The Sims 3, unlike The Sims 4, you could only find certain jobs on certain days. It wasn't a free-for-all where you could just join any career at any time. Oh, she cute. 
We should introduce ourselves to people as they walk by. <gasps> she's cute. Diana Jones, friendly introduction. Let's see if she's still here by the time we look up this newspaper. Oh, look at this cute little park we got next to us. That's nice. And the subway so that we could travel. All right, so music, journalism. Hell yeah, accept it. We have joined the career. Okay, so um, we have a memory. Okay, so we just need mood and writing skill. I don't really know how to work on my writing skill. Uh, where is he going? Oh my God, is he traveling just to go say hi to her? <laughs> okay, buddy. I do have 12,000 simoleons though. Man's committed to saying hello to this woman. There we go, run across the street. Some neighbors have arrived to welcome me to my neighborhood. Well, I'm not home, so maybe I should run home real quick. Oh, we literally traveled across the street. Friendly introduction. Is there anybody upstairs that I need to say hi to? No. Okay. I need to figure out where to get some writing skill because I need to get promoted like ASAP, buddy. ASAP. Because we need to travel. I know what this needs. Turn off these tutorials, dude. How do I? How do I? Because I want to get rid of them. I love that we're just like walking around half naked too. That's cool. Are we running across? Oh my god. Can you be my friend? Let's be- let's make a silly face. That's something- talk about horses. Something I wouldn't recommend doing to a new person, but I don't want to be romantic with him. Talk about composting. Oh hell yeah. Talk about going green. I love this eco-friendly thing. I love it, I love it, love it. He wants to flirt. Oh, we can do that. Not with Devin, but is that his name? Devin, yeah. The ice cream truck. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I love this game. All right, let me, if I zoom out, I know, map view, there is, oh my god, there's so much stuff. Over here? No, that's books. Where is my work? Here. I wonder, okay, I can attend a writing class, so I guess I'm going to do that. I don't know if I can go to like a library and just work on their computer or whatnot. It's been a long time since I've done this. I love that he just jogs everywhere. How are you not exhausted, buddy? We're not going to take a class in athletic skill. This may take a while. Is this going to give me a point? Where is... Oh my god, how do I do anything? Career. His writing is bad. So what are my skills? I currently have no skills. <laughs> same, buddy. Same. Same, Sebastian. Same. Oh, he's almost done. He's almost done. Also, I actually don't mind. Can I change outfits? Here we go every day. And then also I have a cell phone. Shoot. Real estate and travel services, services, take photos, phone settings. Oh my God. I do have a phone. Shoot. Okay. So now, okay. Now I have a skill point. This is in my inventory. All right. So my writing's good. My mood's good. So I'm ready to go to work in t however long it is. Okay. So let me zoom back out and let me see. So it is 3 PM. What can we go do? do let's visit the art gallery we're a cultured man oh my god i'm getting in a taxi how does he decide what's too far oh i'm getting in a taxi to get onto the subway <laughs> the logic and how they travel here is kind of beyond me the only thing i do like about i spotted a celebrity there's celebrities what do i have that's what what who who you Let's greet them. Maybe we can become a celebrity. There's a bar here. All right. I'm just out here to make friends, dude. Try to impress. Let's talk about my occupation. <gasps> I could do film. Oh, shoot. Try to impress. Let's talk about my skill, my writing skill. I have one of those. That is one heck of an outfit. Yikes, she's also a celebrity. He thinks I'm boring. Do you think we could... What if we try to impress her, marry her, take all of her money, and then divorce her? I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Um, hold on, how do I not bore him? Talk about my wealth. I don't have a lot of wealth, but I'll talk about it. I could write a novel eventually. Maybe I should just buy a computer. I have enough money for that. Let's try and talk to this lady. We might try and steal your money. Invite to join my conversation. Do you want to talk to me and this celebrity? 
No, 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 no. Don't leave me. Um, I don't have any other skills. Let's, uh, we can talk about cooking. I mean, this likes children. Same. No, I don't want to ask for her autograph. Stop. Um, talk about my writing skill. No, come back. I need to, <laughs> I need to shoot. Where's journalism? I need to impress you. Impress Emmy. I, look, I'm trying. Let's get rid of flirt and add that in. I'm trying, dude. I'm trying. I want to impress her because I want to marry her and take all of her money. Henry wouldn't do such a thing, but Sebastian would. No, Sebastian's supposed to be a nice guy. Supposed to be. Let's talk about my athletic skill. And let's talk about my non-existent wealth. She don't seem to be into it. She thinks I'm boring. <laughs> Rude. Also, we're getting hungry. I don't think this is going well. Let's talk about my... I don't know if I've talked about my athletic skill yet, but we'll do it. <laughs> talk about journalism again. She really is just not into me. <laughs> Am I supposed to, like, lie to her? Or what? Not, not firefighter. Let's talk about um, film. It would be really cool to get into the film industry. She's so hard to impress, but I mean, she's a four-star celebrity, so under understandable. Charisma. Clearly, Emmy is annoyed and wants to be left alone. Okay, peace out, my dude. Peace out. Where's the other guy? Because I think we almost impressed him. Okay, let's talk about my wealth again with him. And talk about my writing skill. I'm gonna get rid of that. I should have kept flirt. We could have flirted with somebody. I think this guy kind of likes me. So what is it? Wealth? Let's not do that. Leave me alone. Oh, even though I'm the one bothering you. <laughs> Come on, Sebed. Sebastian. Oh. Tell me how I just impressed her right after... Right after I got rid of that stupid thing. Oh my god. So how do I know, like, what... My... Star... Oh, here we go. Celebrity Journal. I have a one star. Okay number of celebrities known too okay i already have a celebrity level i'm at level one star look at me go i'm new to town i haven't done shit and all i've done is come to the art gallery and i'm like you seem like an okay guy sebastian i admit that i'm kind of impressed by you we should hang out more i don't want to hang out with you guys i just wanted to um i don't know i could try and befriend him tell a joke Talk about books. Enthuse about animals. Make a silly face. We could, I guess, be friends with him. I mean, I just want to steal her money, but I'm trying, I'm having this inner debate about whether or not uh, Sebastian would actually do such a thing. I don't know, ma'am. I really don't know. Let's. No, I don't want to. Let's tell one more joke, and then I think we need to go home. Talk about cats. <laughs> Celebrity gossip. Talk about art. And do a little chat. And then after all that, I think we'll go home. Lil Bling has the piano skill. Well, dang diddly, that's amazing. Alright, after we do all these, I think we'll head home. Alan's artistic. So cool. We'll go home because our dude is hungry and about to, like, pee himself. I guess we can use the toilet here. I didn't realize that there was one. Okay, well, we'll stop talking to him and we'll also go home. Where is he? Oh, there he is. Oh, he just- this is an art display. You can't use that. Go home, dude. Did I really just try and tell people to leave the room so that I could use the art toilet? The toilet of art? Oh my god, dude. <laughs> I can't with him. I can't. Okay. Let us use- oh, it's 11 p.m. Um, can I have, like, a quick organic meal of ice cream? I don't want to relax. I want to sleep. All right. Oh, <laughs> he got stuck in the elevator. All right. He got trapped in the elevator doors. He will always remember feeling the door slam on his body as he was trying to get out. That's very unfortunate. Okay, and then so what time do we go to work? Oh, we go at 1 p.m.? Oh, we have plenty of time, my dude. Plenty of time. And everything seems good. So I think we're okay. Did he just down, like, a whole carton of ice cream? Dude. <laughs> That's a lot. 
great. Well, he's comfy, so that's good. All right, so I think I could actually get a desk, probably. Like I said, I have 11,000 simoleons. I think we could get a desk in here. Your sim has started a new relationship, and in a neighborhood like this, it definitely won't go unnoticed. Would you like to learn more about romantic visibility and reputations? No, I don't have any romantic nonsense going on, do I? No. Wait. Oh, that's my boss. I was like, looked a lot like Emmy for a second. I like this girl though, Diana Jones. We might hang out with her more. We might, we might just have to. But I think for the moment, I'm going to leave this part here just because it's getting a little bit long. I know we didn't do a lot uh, because I had to go through Creatism, but I'm actually really excited to be playing this again. It's bringing back like, it's bringing back a lot, <laughs> like so many memories. And I'm super excited about that. And I hope that you guys are excited about it too, because honestly, The Sims 4 is getting a tad boring. Um, I'm trying to find new and interesting things to do with Sims 4 other than just building. I do have the survivor challenge that I just posted recently, so that's come back. But other than that, I'm kind of running out of ideas for The Sims 4. So I'm really excited to dive back into other games like The Sims Medieval. I've posted two videos on that. The Sims 3. I would love to do The Sims 2, but like I said, I don't have the hard, like, discs. And I can't seem to find them online reasonably anywhere, so it's kind of up in the air unless somebody has something that they could recommend for me. But yeah, um, I'm going to ask you guys if you could like this video or dislike this video if you don't like it, if you could leave a comment and if you could subscribe, that would uh, help me out a lot and that would be greatly appreciated. But anyways, guys, I'm going to leave this video here. And as always, have a life, happy time zone, and I will catch you in the next one. Bye!